Today we're talking about the SH-20 Ballistic Shield Backpack, when and how to use it, and how I like to build around it. Let me know your thoughts about this stratagem in the comments. First things first, do not use this against the bugs. They don't care about your shield. You'll be trampled, spit on, and sliced up. I also wouldn't suggest using this for smaller automaton arena maps like Eradicate or Escort missions since you will get swarmed from all sides and the shield won't be of much help. I find the Ballistic Shield excels on medium to large automaton maps like Blitz or Sabotage Air Bases. So now we know when to bring the shield, how do we use the shield? Let's start with movement. While standing or running, the shield will block your left side. Running to the right, perpendicular to the enemy, is safer than running to the left. While aiming, the shield will cover most of your front even more so while crouching. You can place the shield on your back by switching to your support weapon or by emoting. While on your back, it will cover your upper body but leaves your legs exposed. This is still great for when you have to run away from the enemy. You can even help teammates run away by running behind them. Diving with the shield is not an issue in most cases, but if you dive from high enough with the shield out, you will drop it and have to pick it back up. However, you won't drop it diving from the same height with the shield on your back. I would also recommend becoming comfortable switching camera sides so you can aim at targets on either side of the shield without turning. You can also go into a turtle mode if you crouch and move. I haven't found a use for this yet. Still experimenting. The ballistic shield can withstand a lot of firepower, fully blocking any gunfire that doesn't have an explosive AoE. It will block a rocket, but you will take a small bit of damage and ragdoll. Same for larger blasts from towers or annihilator tanks, but in addition to reduced damage and ragdolling, your shield will break. The loadout that I like to use when bringing the shield consists of the SMG-37 Defender, the GP-31 Grenade Pistol, and the G-23 Stun Grenade. For armor, I use the FS-34 Exterminator. It's a medium armor with 50% resistance to explosive damage and 30% reduced recoil while crouching. I got this armor from the Superstore. For stratagems, I like to bring the Orbital Rail Cannon, Orbital Laser, and the LAS-98 Laser Cannon. If I'm forced to only choose three, I'll leave off the Orbital Laser. I don't have a preferred booster, I just choose whatever I think is best for the situation. I like this loadout because it helps me deal with threats of all types, and at all ranges. Playing a ballistic shield build is a lot of fun, and I think you'll be surprised by the situations you can survive while using it. Yes, at the moment it is only viable in a small slice of the game. Also, its defensive playstyle means you won't be top of the kill board. However, you will be able to tank and overpower most automaton enemies and still provide value to the team. I plan to revisit this stratagem once the Illuminate are released and see how it plays against them.